Here we are in beautiful Eastwood Village. We are just 12 minutes from downtown Asheville. We have restaurants in this community. Beautiful open plan. This is the number one thing requested from any of our buyers. Gas, fireplace. Lots of nice touches, like look at this lighting fixture over the dining table. I love this. Eat at breakfast bar here. The laundry is on the main level, as is the garage, double car garage. That's the other main thing requested. Is your half bath. The hardwood floors look like new. A beautiful deck off the back. That is this door. Boop, 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 rewind. This door right here off the kitchen. There's also a door off the master bedroom. Your laundry is right here. There's a hall closet here. Oversized double garage. This is where I get to echo. And let's go and take a look at the master bedroom. Cathedral ceiling. Now we've got trails off the back. I love this. It's not one of the houses that have houses on both sides. This is one of those communities where you're close to your neighbours, which means you can hang out with the ones that you like and ignore all the others. I'm just kidding. You're going to love all the neighbourhood. Neighbours. You've got a double vanity here. And a large walk-in closet. You've got a separate toilet. A lot of people like that. With a door on it. You've got this large walk-in closet. It's so large, I'm in it. Large shower, plus your jet tub there, your garden tub. And here's your deck. You've got views off here, you've got views off your master. Now, if you've got puppies or you like to go wandering, there's a gate here and three steps down and here's your trail. There are lots of trails through here where you can walk. It is part of the community, community trails. You've got all this land around here too, but hopefully you can see it on the video. It goes down to the gate there. And you've got these beautiful views. This humongous deck, if you don't want to go out and play in the rest of your yard, you've got this large deck. I am a deck girl myself, I don't know how you feel about that. Um, we don't get too many bugs here, I've lived in different parts of the country, and very few bugs. You don't see that many screened in porch, but really good size here. And the door that you see there, hardy plank exterior, the door that you see there is through to the kitchen. So you've got the two ways out, which I love. Let's take you out the front. We are back into the main area. Oversized front door here. You do have a keypad on the front, which is really nice. You have to worry about keys. You've got lots of driveway space here as well. There's the trails off there. Lots of people walk their dogs in there or go for a stroll in there. This great front porch. So here's the bonus room. You see this is a large room. 
You're looking out onto the trails next door. Just lovely, all the trees out there, double closet in here. I see all the carpet's been removed from the original build. You've got nickel hardware, which makes it look more modernized than the old brass. Here's your linen cupboard. Look the tile on the floor and the guest bath. They're all good sized bedrooms. This one has, let me see if I can get the light to change here. There you go. Very pretty view from the window. Another good sized closet in here. You've got the little arts and crafts tail in the framing there of the door. And then the pièce de résistance. I love this room. So you've got a custom closet in here. So shelves and lamps and then you've got your balcony. Who wouldn't love this? Covered porch off this bedroom. It's a very quiet neighbourhood. It's about 12 minutes to downtown. If you're familiar with Fairview, you're just on the edge of Fairview. You can tell how quiet it is here. This is all the neighbourhood. Beautiful arts and crafts. Homes. Des designed with a traditional neighbourhood feel. So you've got little stores, there, which are literally right there. Um, little stores, sandwich shop, um, uh, restaurant. All kinds of things just down the street. You've actually got two or three restaurants down there. 